Exactly how do jet engines operate? The majority of jet-powered aircraft are turbofan-powered. The turbofan can be visualized as a sophisticated propeller inside a diffuser, a duct that is powered by a gas generator. A gas generator, which produces high-pressure gas to power a turbine, is at the center of a jet engine. This system consists of a compressor combustion chamber and a turbine. Compared to the size of the engine, the combustion reaction is significantly more powerful with compressed air from the compressor. Compression occurs gradually, forcing entering air into a smaller and smaller chamber. A single compressor stage is made up of a rotor that spins and a ring of stator vanes that are motionless and fastened to the cork casing. As the air is forced through the compressor, rotor blades swirl it. Stator vanes boost air pressure while decreasing this spinning momentum. For low pressure stages and 10 high pressure stages make up the compressor. As it moves through the combustor, the combustor air is combined with fuel and ignited, generating a jet of extremely powerful gas. The inlet nozzles receive compressed air. Each nozzle has a fuel injector attached to it, and its purpose is to mix the air and gasoline entering the engine evenly. This combination is ignited by a couple of igniter plugs, which are similar to the spark plugs used in automobile engines, and the reaction spreads equally around the ring. Once combustion has begun, it continues as long as fuel and air are available. The exhaust gases leaving the combustor power the turbine at the back of the jet engine. The fan is powered by a large portion of the turbine's power, whereas the compressor stages are powered by a smaller portion. Portion of the air from the compressor is redirected for cooling and specific purposes after turbine fins become excessively hot. In order to lower heat, coatings are utilized. To mix and speed up exhaust streams, the exhaust cone is specifically designed. It also includes delicate internal engine components. Jet engine noise is significantly influenced by exhaust velocity. For quieter operation, high bypass engines surround the rapidly moving core exhaust with significant amounts of the more slowly moving bypass air. A jet pipe segment receives additional fuel spray, which mixes with exhaust gas and ignites to create the second stage of combustion. The exhaust nozzle is adjustable for maximum exhaust acceleration and to prevent unwelcome back pressure that might destroy engine parts because afterburners are normally utilized in brief bursts during takeoff rise or combat maneuvers.